hopping on kick and somebody claimed that they were 15. They didn't look 15 to me. Um, and I drove to this gas station. Due to the graphic nature of this video, viewer discretion is advised. Everyone in this video is innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Do not attempt to contact, harass, bully, or threaten anyone in this video. This video is to raise awareness of the dangers of online predators. Parents, stay vigilant and be aware of what your children are doing online. Do not try this at home. Avon, Indiana, a suburban community west of Indianapolis. It's known for its small town feel, friendly community, and many amenities. Avon is home to the Haunted Bridge that's over White Lick Creek, award-winning schools, great parks, Improv clubs. So there's definitely things to do while you're in Avon, Indiana. Unlike the man today, he decided to come to Avon to meet up with a little girl. So the man we're talking about today is a man named Ken. Now, Ken started talking to this girl on the app Kick. This is an older catch. This was in 2020. We were still pretty new at doing this. Now, unfortunately, I do not have a large chunk of the beginning chats with this guy. But when you see the confrontation, he admits that it was him talking. He admitted that he was talking to who he thought was a four-year-old girl he thought he was meeting a f old girl so we are not making any of this up we are not setting him up i'll read some of the chats but the beginning chats we do not have it's just something that does happen we do so many catches some of the chats can go missing especially when we first started we're, we weren't as organized as we are now so you will have to forgive us for not having the beginning chats for this guy. You will see the confrontation and he owns up to everything. So nothing that we are saying is false. But here Ken says, do you mean meet somewhere else or go somewhere after the mall? Where else would you want to go? Now he thinks this girl is 14 years old. She says, I don't know. I mean, go somewhere else. He says, do you really think you should be getting in my car? She says, uh, I don't know why, should I not? He says, it's not good practice, sweetie. What if I'm not really a nice person at all? I could take you somewhere and do bad things. So I don't know what he's trying to do, um, try to make her feel comfortable. I mean, it's kind of weird for him to even say that. Like, you are meeting this girl that you don't know, and she's underage. I could take you somewhere and do bad things. Like, that's, that's a weird thing to say. She said, I mean, if you don't want to, that's cool. Just thought we could go somewhere else because you said you want to see my face without mask. He says, I want to. I'm just worried about you being in the habit of going places with strange men. Like you said, we can talk about it when we meet. So he's one of these guys that we've seen this before. These guys will say, tell the decoys, well, you shouldn't be doing this. You shouldn't meet up with strange men. You shouldn't meet up with strangers. You got to be careful. But if it's me, you can do that because you can trust me. We see that all the time. These, these guys will make it seem like they are okay to meet, but any other guy, it, they're not okay to do. Even though this guy talked about several things. Here he talks about the park. He says, if only there were a place where people could go to be together for a little while. She says, what do you mean? He says, I'd laugh out loud. He says, hey, is it okay if another girl that he's talking to comes with us? Another girl that's underage. Um, this girl is um, 
one of T-Coy's decoys that he was talking to. So he was talking to, um, he might have been talking to two of T-Coy's decoys, but I can't remember. He was at least talking to one of T-Coy's decoys. So he wanted to bring this other girl to meet up with him and, and this girl. He says, I don't know, we can ride around. I have to, I'll have to take home. You can ride with me there if you want. Then I can take you home or back to the mall to be picked up. She says, ride around, so like just drive around and not go anywhere. He says, well, if we think of some place to go, we can go there. He says that the other girl says she's not sure if she can go. She says, okay. He says, it might be just you and me, smiley face. She says, sounds like you'd like that. He says, maybe, even if she comes, I can drop her off first. So the decoy sends a couple pictures of herself. He says, wow, super cute pictures. Looks like kind of a sexy top. She says, am I sexy in it? He says, show me more of it and I'll tell you. He says, what are you wearing now? She sends another picture. He says, you're a little babe. She says, hee hee, I am. He says, looks like it. She says, scale of one to 10. He says, I'd give you a solid 8.5 right now. I think girls keep improving until their 30s, so you're on track to be a 10 for sure. She says, wish I had a boyfriend as sweet as you. He says, you will, it just takes a while. Guys don't really appreciate girls until they get a little older. She says, how come you don't have a girlfriend? He says, maybe I do. He says, we're both still seeing other people. We're just dating a few times. She says, oh, okay. He says, were you getting jealous? She says, maybe. He says, yeah, hot girls be like that. By the way, just to make sure, you know we're not going to be boyfriend, girlfriend, right? I like you and think you're sweet and cute. I want to do something nice for you, is that okay? She says, oh. He says, I'm sorry, I assumed you would feel the same way because of my age. She says, I mean, I didn't say we were gonna be, but I honestly don't mind the age. He says, I'd like to spend some time with you and have fun doing stuff, but it's just for fun. He says, is that okay? Cause I'm really looking forward to Sunday. He says, hey, I really do love these pictures you sent me today. I meant everything I said. He sends one of the pictures that she sent him. He says, I've been staring at this one a lot. She says, really? Why are you staring at it? Thought you don't like me like that. He says, I do like you like that. It just can't be serious. In five years, you'll be wanting to go to college parties and have lots of crazy fun. I'll just want to sit in my rocking chair and watch Andy Griffith reruns. He says, are we still on for tomorrow? I have a lot of stuff going on because of Christmas, but we could get together from like two to four if you want. I know that's not very long. I wish it could be more. Let me know what you think. He says, I think it would be okay for a first meeting though. Hint you, not sure what he means by that. We can get you a bear, walk around and talk, have a cookie. If you feel safe with me, I can drive you home. Here he is, he says, I'm really sorry, sweetie, I can't meet tomorrow. My mom is 91 and she got really sick and is in the hospital, so sorry. And later he says, you're a cutie. She says, you think so? He says, definitely. She says, just cute? He says, you're more than cute. She says, hot? He says, maybe, I'll decide after I see you in person. Keep in mind, I feel like I have to be careful what I say on here. She says, what do you mean? He says, it's illegal for me to talk about sexy things with you. So here we go, like, here you see, he's admitting that it's illegal for him to be talking about certain things with this girl. Then here he says, I wish you were here with me. She says, oh, where? He says, here at home, watching TV. You know, Netflix and chill, laugh out loud. I could fix you a cup of hot chocolate. She says, oh, Netflix and chill, I know what that means. He says, really? Tell me what it means. I thought it just means hanging out together. She says, um, laugh out loud, no. It means watch Netflix and mess around, make out and other stuff. He says, mm, that sounds pretty good. She says, it does? He says, you like kissing? She says, I love kissing. You? He says, of course, on the lips, on the neck, over the shoulders, the finer tips, <laughs> toes, and everything in between. She says, stop, you're making me think. He says, think what? She says, about kissing. He says, where would you like to be kissed? She says, on the lips, of course. He says, where else? She says, neck. He says, mm, I'll bet it smells good. Then he eventually says, have you ever been kissed down there? She says, I haven't. Wonder what it feels like. 
He says, you can't even imagine. Been touched down there? She says, I've been touched a couple of times around the X, but it was short. He says, did you like it? She says, it was nice. He said, do you ever touch yourself? She says, yeah. He says, mm, I'd like to see that. She said, you want to watch me do that? He said, it would be sexy. She says, I I'm sorry I keep forgetting your name. He says, my name is Ken. I would love a video. Will it get me in trouble? Then she just sends a video of her saying, hi, how you doing? Then he says, I'll watch it over and over as I'm in bed trying to fall asleep. She says, it's just going to keep you up. He says, yes, it is. Is that what you're trying to do? She says, is what, what I'm trying to do? He says, are you trying to keep me up at night thinking about you? She says, ha no. He says, yes, you are. She says, nope, can't help that you like me. He says, it's totally your fault that you sent me that sweet video. She says, I want my Build-A-Bear. He says, that's not what I'm going to be thinking about, but you'll get your bear. She says, what are you going to be thinking about? He says, all kinds of things that have to stay just in my head. She says, oh, why? I want to know. He says, you know, like those neck kisses and hands feeling you. He says, you would like it too. She says, I would. He says, kisses all the way down your backbone. Hands sliding, hands sliding, I think he meant sliding over you, your stomach, your chest, sliding over your butt. He says, what else do you want? Do you want me to touch you anywhere else? Where did you go, baby? She says, I want you to tell me where else I want to touch me. She meant to say you. He says, can I slide my hands over your chest more? He says, can I touch your nipples? She says, yes, please. He says, mm, pinch them a little bit. Roll them between my fingers. Would you like me to kiss them and flick them with my tongue? I'll try not to them too hard. When I get excited, I can get carried away. He says, can you be my hands for me? And she says, what do you mean? He says, touch yourself in the places I say I want to touch you. She says, oh, okay. He said, I want to slide my hand across your stomach slowly and up to your perfect little breast. Does it feel nice? She says, mm, yes. He says, are your nipples hard? She says, little. He says, pinch them a little and make them hard for me. Roll them back and forth so it feels really good. Imagine me lying between you, kissing your neck and whispering in your ear how much I live to feel them. Now I'm kissing hard on your neck. I hope I don't leave any marks as I slide my hand down. He says, long, long waits though. I want to feel like you're here with me. I can't do that if it takes you 29 minutes to respond. Getting mad because she's not responding quick enough. A lot of these dudes get so, they just get so mad when we don't respond quick enough. Then the next day he says, hey, sorry about last night. I guess I got a little jealous when I thought you might be talking to someone else while I was trying to have a special sexy moment with you. <laughs> Imagine getting jealous of a year old. Then later on he says, I could give you a really, really good massage, warm oil, soft, sexy music, dim lights, including your feet, of course. Then here they're talking about meeting up, uh, meeting up at Meyer. He spelled Meyer weird. Then here he sends a picture of himself. <laughs> he is on the way to meet the girl right now. And he shows up and I end up confronting him. I went solo on this catch. Um, it was a pretty good one. Um, he admitted that it was him. He tried to act like he really wasn't going to do anything, blah, blah, blah. Y'all know the bullshit. Cops showed up, took all the evidence. Yeah, he, he was just a sick man. Now, here's a message that he sent to one of t -Coy's decoys. Um, so she, he was talking to two of t -Coy's decoys. He says, hey, I can't, I can't talk anymore. I arranged to meet someone from the group today, and it turned out to be a guy from a group that exposes pedophiles. He broadcasted me live on Facebook, accusing me of being one. My life is going to be ruined now. Everyone I know is going to think I'm a p The police even came and questioned me. Please don't tell anyone I told you this. It could get me into more trouble. So, <laughs> like, this just, just craziness. Like, why even say all that? Just tell the girl you can't talk anymore. So, I mean, here he is admitting that he, he got caught trying to meet up with a kid. So he's talking, he's telling another kid, I'm not sure how old this decoy was, under the age of 15, but it's just sad. Like he was talking to three decoys, probably talking to more. He was in teen chat rooms as a sick, sick man. But let's get to the confrontation. Um, like and subscribe so you can 
make sure you don't miss any um, exposure videos so y'all can see who is doing this in your community and you can be aware. Also join our local so you can see uncensored, full chats and full confrontations. Yo, Ken. K-Mad. What's up, man? You wanna explain yourself, man? <laughs> yeah, you know what's up. Yeah. You knew it was you yeah, it's happening. You wanna explain yourself, man? What are you thinking, man? A 14-year-old girl, bro. A 14-year-old girl. So we can we can like talk somewhere where people won't hear us. I just wanna have a conversation. I'm not with the police. I'm not here to fight you or anything. I just wanna have a conversation, man. So if you want to talk somewhere where people, right? I appreciate the conversation. You know, because what you, what you are here to do, man, is absolutely f disgusting, man. What are you thinking, man? You want to go? We can go in the aisle where no one, go in the aisle where no one can hear us. This is for my protection and your protection. That way you can't. Not for my protection. Oh yeah, it is for your. It is for your protection. Believe me, bro. It is for your protection because now I can't. I can't attack you or anything because it's evidence right here, right? Um, I'm the whole time. Okay, you. You're the one I've been talking to. I might have been. Okay. Um, you. I hope you can tell that I've been torn. Right. Torn between this is right and this is wrong. Yes. I don't know, man. To me, it seems like you. No, 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 no. You were being careful what you were saying online. You even repeat. You said it like six or eight times. I have to be careful about what I say on here. Yeah. You said it, dude. Like you were very careful. You were very careful because you knew what you were doing. You were being careful, man. I'm also yes. I'm being careful because. I knew, part of me knew this is what was going to happen. Right. Or a good probability. Okay. Right. Um, but also torn between just being nice to somebody. Can I, know? I can't really hear, I have bad hearing. Can, can you take your mask down so I can, I'll, I'll step back a little bit. Can you take your mask down so I can hear you better? Or I'll just call the cops. <laughs> well, I uh, haven't done anything illegal. You def you talk sexual to a minor and you met up with her. That's illegal. Uh, a f year old. You talk sex. You you said sexual things that you wanted to do to her, man. You said things that you wanted to. That's illegal, man. You did it. We don't. I don't meet up with anyone that does not cross that line. If you never said anything illegal, we would not be here. That's why it took so. I waited so long, bro, because you were so careful. The first like week or two, you said nothing, almost nothing sexual. And then that night, you just you 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 dropped the ball, bro. You dropped the ball. You started talking. Yeah. So you did. You, you trust me, man. We've had we've had four guys arrested. Trust me, man. You you did something illegal, and you know you did. So can you take your mask down so I can hear you better? Thank you. Appreciate it. I I appreciate that. I appreciate that. You got pictures of me anyway. Oh, I do. I'm, I'm doing it for my hearing. I have bad hearing. It's not until I can get your picture. That doesn't matter. I mean, what, what do you have to say for yourself? 
bakal nothing really um, I I'm torn between she, she told me the story she doesn't have a dad her dad's not in her life uh, her mom she painted the picture that her mom was an alcoholic and not giving her you know doesn't doesn't pay any attention to her so my first instinct was I just want to be nice to this girl but as as the conversation went on and at times she said things that suggested she might want might be interested in more than that she suggested she come on man come on i know you want to tell the truth you're you're starting to tell the truth just tell the truth man and even if she did even if she did she's a fucking yeah. minor you're the adult right right you're right come on bro <laughs> come on man oh, that's hard you well, like kids i've never you no uh, you like kids you're a man you know that no i've you're in you're in teen dude you hit me up in a teen group chat you're talking to real minors on that chat all those other girls they think i'm a real girl you thought i was a real girl you're talking to actual minors you're talking to i know you're talking to an 11 year old and a 12 year old those are real f on there i i'm not the one you were talking yes yeah. she's not real but the other ones are f real bro so what if you met up with one of them what if you met up with one of them instead of my my girl huh you would have met up with a real real minor even younger you said keep in mind i feel like i have to be careful what i say on here right you said that right can you be my hands for me what do you mean? You, you touch yourself to in places I say I want you to touch. You I want to, to slide my hand across your stomach slowly and up to toward perfect little breasts. Does it feel nice? Mm, yes. Are your nipples hard? You really don't have to repeat it for me. Kisses right? all the way down your backbone, hands sliding over you, your stomach, your chest, sliding over your little butt. Where would you like to be kissed? You see, man? Okay, let's go away from those kids, bro. What is going through your head, man? Like, what? what is it, man? Like, you just like little kids? That's what it is? Like, little kids turn you on? No. No. Well, dude, you were talking. I just read the messages. Okay. I just read the messages. I'm, you, that's you. I was... She talked to me. Um, she talked to you. Yes, she was willing to talk to me. So you don't like what? Because no one else talks to you. I don't. I've never. I've never. I, I've never met with anyone underage. I've never met with anyone. Okay. Right. It's um. Like ever in your life, this is your first time. Yeah. Is this your first time talking to a minor? As far as I know. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> Dude, we just went through this. I met you in the group. I met you. I met you in the group chat. You're talking to real minors. I'm like one of the last girls you started talking to. You were talking to the. I don't even know how long you were talking to those minors, the real minors. You want to see the conversations I had with them? I'll I'll bring out my phone and show you. I mean, I don't, it doesn't really matter what the conversations you had with them, because well, actually, I, I want you to do something. D delete, delete, delete yourself off that group chat right now. delete yourself off that you're not going to continue to talk to those minors on there let me see are you admin um i was i think they they took that no don't lie don't lie are you admin right now are you admin i don't know you don't they, know i don't know you they, don't know i do not know they made me admin for about a day to set you, up the rage bot how do you how do you get off how do you do you know how to take yourself off of admin it's <laughs> It'll sound weird, but I appreciate you doing this. You appreciate me. Yes, so I, I you appreciate you appreciate me busting your ass. Yes. Why? Because you know you have a problem. I don't have a Oh my god, bro, okay. come on, bro! I stopped. I stopped. I stopped. I haven't done anything before this. Okay? I've had 
I've had feelings, I've had inclinations, I've had interest. I haven't, okay? So I don't know what I need to do to make sure it doesn't happen again. I need to talk to somebody. You need something. You need to get like a counselor, therapist, something, bro. Like seriously, you cannot be doing this, bro. This is nasty. This is disgusting, bro. You were to ruin that girl's life. If you would have taken her home and gave her a massage and more, you would have that girl. Let's be real. You would have her. Tell the truth. You would have got her home, got her naked, massaged her body at her house alone, and you would have her. Right. Just, just I be honest. Deny the possibility. I won't say you would f her, man. I, <laughs> just I to stop it, bro. To. I would be willing to. Yes, there you go. But, you, you would be willing to fuck a fourteen-year-old. There you go. Be. But what did I say when I was talking? I said I will respect your boundaries. Didn't I well, say that? So, yeah, you did. So what? Okay, maybe, right. you, maybe you were a guy that wouldn't like force her to have sex with right. you. Maybe you wouldn't rape her I that way, right? You, so you, you, so you wouldn't rape her. I, and I wouldn't coerce. Wait, you wouldn't rape her, right? Absolutely. Would you have sex with her though? I it's a yes or no I question. Okay, okay. What is what is forced? It's forced. It was when, it, when you have sex with someone that does not give you consent, right? Yes. Can a minor give you consent? No. So therefore, having sex with a minor is rape. You're right. Okay. And by the way, you can leave whenever you want, man. I'm not here. I'm not forcing you to stay. I'm not holding you against your will. I'm not, but I'm I'm ready to go. You can go whenever you want. You go. You gonna chase me? Or I'm not gonna chase you. you. I'm gonna follow. I will follow you. I'm gonna follow you until you leave. Cause I have to get you leaving the property. So, cause it, like I said, this is evidence in case something happens. No. Like you can't go off and smack, stab yourself, and then say, "Oh, that guy stabbed me." Well, I have the proof that we met and you left and we parted okay. ways. That's that's what this is. For you, so you have that. Well, I'm probably going to hand over the evidence to the detectives. Why, why are you laughing, though? Is this funny? Is this funny? Is this funny? Is this funny? No. Why are you fucking laughing, then? Why are you laughing, then, bro? Because when we first met, you got me to talk by saying that you weren't with the cops. Either. I'm not with the cops. Uh, I'll probably blast you all over the internet too, just so you know. Yeah, that's good. Um, I'm probably gonna post the video on YouTube tonight. Is that okay with you? <laughs> oh, wait, 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 oh yeah. Wait, I'll, I'll, if you, if you, um, I won't post the video on YouTube tonight. If you do something, if you, all the way out, you walk like this. <laughs> You're getting blasted, bro. <laughs> You're getting blasted. You're getting blasted. Ken, is Ken your real name? Is Ken your real name? Is Ken your real name? Ken? Don't apologize to him. He's a pedophile. <laughs> she laughed. Bro, you're nasty, bro. Never do this again in your life, bro. Ever. You hear me? You hear me, bro? Never do this again in your life, bro. All right? I agree. Huh? I agree. You better agree, bro. You better agree. That's someone's daughter, man. That's somebody's daughter. You should be ashamed of yourself, bro. You should be ashamed of yourself, man. You disgust me, man. Real talk. You're real talk, bro. You disgust me. The walk of shame, bro. Hey, can you... Hey, can I stand on your umbrella while I have the phone? Just so I don't get my phone wet? Ken. Ken. Hey, man. I want to know. I want to know. No, I, I have a serious question. Like, is it, is it, is it like the kid? Is it the kid aspect? Or is it more like age is just a number? Like, help me, dude. I'm trying to figure why guys do this. Is it, the, is it because you like kids? Or is it because um, age is just a number to you, Ken? So you're not talking anymore? Is it because you like kids? Or is it because age is... A, hey, this guy's a pedophile, bro. <laughs> what? What, you want to do something? What, you want to do something? What's up, Ken? What's up, though? You want to do something? 
do it. Make my day, bro. I'm not violent though. Like that's not what I'm about. I don't fight people, but I will protect myself. If you do something, man, don't do it. Because you like kids, or is it because? Dude, where the fuck did you park, bro? Where did you park? Dude, this this dude parking in Egypt. Bro, where'd you go? Oh my god. You're gonna have me walk, bro. God damn it. Where'd you park, dude? Seriously, where'd you park? Ken, where did you park, bro? For real. Just tell me where you park. You walked here? From where? From where, bro? From where? Ken. You're lying, dude. You live this close? You live this close? Ken? God damn it, you had me walking. Dude, dude. Oh, you just lying so I stop following you? Hey, bro, I'll follow you all day long, dude. Just so you know, you might as well go back to your car. Ken. Come on, man. Seriously, dude. Why, why are you doing this, man? Why are you doing this? Dude, you could get... Dude, hey, seriously, man. What if it was the dad that came up here? He would kill you, dude. He would kill you. Or the big brother or the uncle or something. Okay, you got me convinced. What else do you want? I'm talking to you. Okay. I am talking to you. Okay. Okay, don't get smart with me. What do you want? I'm just talking to you. You can leave. I don't care, but I'm going to follow you until you get to your car. I'm not going to my car. Why? Because I don't want you to see my license plate. <laughs> I'm not I will walk with you all day long, bro. My phone's at 88% battery. Google. What the hell's wrong with you, man? You want to do? You want to get some wings? No, I don't want to. Yeah, let's go in there. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go inside of wings, etc. Let's go. You can film me walking down that way. I'm going to wait for you in the parking lot. <laughs> I ain't going nowhere, bro. I ain't fucking going nowhere. Right? Right? People know, bro. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Stay on his Right. Right. So I told you, bro. People know what I do around here, bro. Hey, can I use your... Can I use your umbrella real quick so I can fix something? No, I don't think so. <laughs> Come on, kid. Like you actually do. You actually were gonna invite that other girl to meet up with us. That would have been weird as shit. It would have been a real minor and me. Because we were going to the mall to, to build a bear. Yeah, to build a bear. Yeah, yeah. build a bear. Going on be a build a bear, bear. Can I still get that build a bear, bro? That's still weird, man. How old, how old was that girl? I can't remember how old she was. She is. She's 14, right? Or 13. No, she was no, she was 11. Don't say her name. Don't say her name. Don't say her name. 12. 12. You going to hit me with that? No, no, no. <laughs> Part of the reason for that having someone else there would have prevented anything further. Being with two girls, we would go to the mall, we would buy ice cream, and that would be the end of it. It's safer than with one. Right. And not to justify my actions or anything, but I think it's curious that the only person I got to this point with is the one who was fake. <laughs> I think that says something. That you're more willing to go with me than real people. Oh, there's the cops. How you doing, sir? You're, you're aware of what's happening? Not yet, nope. Okay. Hang out over there. All right, can I please leave it? Step over here and just talk to me, okay? okay? Yeah. Okay, so. 
Okay, so I run, I run an online okay, account. Hang, oh, hang, hang on, y'all. Sorry. So I run an online, uh, I run an organization that catches online, that catches online child predators. Yeah. And so our, uh, our decoy was posing as a 14 year old girl. And that man came here to meet her. And he thought after having a sexual conversation with her. So he met up with her. He's going to take her back to her house, massage her. And, and sexual, other sexual stuff. So that's that's what we do. Um, Muncie police know what we do. Alexandria police know what we do. We've had a couple of arrests with the Alexandria police. So um, police are aware of what we do. Um, okay. We haven't I haven't worked with anyone here in Avon yet. Um, this hasn't happened, but so that's okay. that's what we do. All right. Well, I got my uh, project on the way. Okay. Okay. First off, let me get your name.